to the arts centre as home to the largest critical care unit in the whole of Europe. Now, when Jack Eaton Bell was born, he was a very poorly baby. At just a day old, he needed emergency heart surgery to save his life. Showing incredible bravery, he pulled through. In fact, almost two years later, he's now so fit and healthy, he's just won a baby modelling competition. Tessa went to meet his very proud mum and dad. Tell me where the pussycat is. Every parent thinks their own baby is gorgeous, but with Jack Eaton, it's official. Meet the winner of a national modelling competition for toddlers. For his proud mum and dad, it's proof that Jack can do anything after a tough start to life. At just a day old, he was diagnosed with a congenital heart condition. A nine-hour open heart operation followed, then five days in intensive care. I don't think anything could prepare you for what he looked like. He just... I'd only had him. You know, like a day earlier, I didn't recognise him at all. He was all, all puffy and with a ventilator and the intensive care scary anyway. But following them, every day was good news. Jack's made incredible progress, and apart from regular checkups, he's no different to any other two year old. Except perhaps for his blossoming career. His grandparents entered him, and his good looks and temperament won him a one year contract. He Cooperated, listened, played, smiled for the camera, did a little dance. Yeah, and uh, it was great. It was a great photographer who knew what he was doing, but and he brought out the best in him. But no one's taking Jack's career too seriously. It's something that he can keep a look back on, and sort of thing like she was first girlfriend. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> next shoots go well, then his contract could be extended. Although for now, his main ambition seems to lie in the same place as most little boys, on the football field. Tessa Chapman, Five News, Liverpool. And of course, hope he's a red. Coming up on Five